M0FXB, welcome to my channel, Uniden BCT15 and the ProScan software which has a free trial and the link will be in the description. Going to show you the different view options. This is connected at the front with a USB connection to my PC and I have used an adapter but you can buy a direct cable on eBay and Amazon. So let's just show you the view selections. I mean you can control everything using this software but I just wanted to show you the view because they're quite cool. So this is the standard view. If I click view it says normal display. And we can, you know, we can press the menu, we can hold, yeah, we can do everything that you can do, turn the volume up, everything, it's all there. Click on the buttons and scroll with your mouse and so on. The next view option you get is display menu only. So this will shrink it right down, as you can see, and you're seeing the screen and then, but you still got all these different menu choices that you can adjust as well. So quite a lot there to uh, tinker with. If we go back to view and we'll go display only. Now this is actually sizable and I have set it to um, to actually take the full screen. But you can click on it and you can scroll your mouse on this. It's quite fiddly, so sort of click the left and then scroll up and down with your other finger to resize it. And if you right click on it, you get these different display options as you can see and it pretty much tells you what to do and then if we want to e exit this display mode you can select that or you can do full, full screen as well. So we're back to the original selections and we go file again. Uh, I like this one, scanner only. I quite like this one. You still get all the menus here on the main thing but you also get the scanner only and you can move that around. I'm pretty sure there is a setting to keep it on top. So that's quite cool. I think it won't let me resize this. And it, see when it goes red, that's because it's receiving something. We'll turn it up and see if it receives anything. Then we'll go view. There's a GB3WR. Try another one. Reset default program size and position. So that's default. So that's the actual software and the thing and the, the device. I like it's fun, isn't it? I mean, it's what I like about scanners. You get all this, and there's a lot of free software out there as well. View, reset, default grid column width, and all these other. There's the always on top. I thought there was one. So if we now go view, we selected always on top, scanner only. Yeah, and it's always on top, as you can see. Here's someone talking now. Let's turn the volume up. We'll click here. That's GB3WR, we can click hold. It's like any any radio device, it's as good as the antenna you've got. Higher the better, and you want clear line of sight to the op to the items that you're listening to. So if it's an aeroplane flying over, you can't go far wrong. You've got search here. Hold, resume, menu. GPS, but you do need an item. We can scroll down to search for. You've got quite a few settings in search for. Look. Click me, uh, enter there. There's your enter. Service search. That is where you watch this. You'll see that that's. You can choose that. And we're now searching public safety. Not that I've uh, ever done that before. So, of course, this software works on many, many different scanners. To open software, if we go back to normal display. You, when you open software, if you've never used it before, you do have to choose to open something. So you go database, open, and normally you can uh, open a, an existing file. There's one there. Or what else can you do? You can go to database there, try it, and then you've got download and upload to scanner, add and delete, and you have sit. The system they use is systems. It is a bit confusing for me. You have systems. Let's go back to our... There's a system. See the thing Bristol? That is a system. Within the system, you have group, a group. Okay, so the group name here is... Yeah, interesting name. Yeah, and within that group, double-click, you have channels. That's how it works. And you can change all of this. You can rename everything. 
you can assign the group to have a, a fast key. So you push number one and it will take you to that. But if we go to the system. You can also assign the, the, uh, the system to have a key. So let's give it a key there. Quick key there. That's a group. Let's go to a system. My channels. That's a system. You can rename the the. Uh, we've got a quick key on my favorites, and so on and so on. So you know, even I get very confused doing all of this. But then you click upload to scanner. You tell it what you want it to upload. You can upload the whole lot if you want. You do need to s tick up here. Look, send selected systems, upload. So have fun learning. And the thing about scanners is they are all about learning. There's hundreds and hundreds of hours of learning and you, it can drive you crazy. But the end reward is when you're using one of these scanners and there's many out there, um, you will really enjoy yourself. That's all I can say. Thanks for watching my channel. Good audio, nice big, not very good quality item, the, the BCT-15. All those mobile type scanners from you are very nice. 7.3, please remember to like and subscribe. Bye for now.